Hello everyone, today's tutorial will be showing you how to make a miniature pine tree and how to decorate it for Christmas. I will be using Woodland Scenic Pine Tree for the base. You can use a well dried twig from your garden as well, something like a dried asparagus or a foxtail fern will work best. I bent the scenic pine to my liking and you can use some heat if the plastic is too hard just to make it a bit easier. Next you will need some craft foam in green. You can use scenic foliage if you like, however if you're a cheapo like me you can grate some dehydrated kitchen sponges and use that instead. To dehydrate the kitchen sponges, get a clean one from the packet and put it in the oven on low until it's really hard before you grate it. Then glue on the foliage a little bit at a time using some tacky glue, being careful to press in each piece and thoroughly dry it before you move on to the next bit. The scenic trees are designed for a fully grown tree, so they're a bit thinner than a traditional Christmas tree, so I will be continuing to layer foam until I have the desired thickness. Make sure each layer is thoroughly dry before you add more. If you have trouble with the foam not sticking very well, you can also water down some tacky glue and spray your tree after each layer. Once you're happy with your tree, you can lightly spray some white paint on it to mimic snow. Now for some decorations. You can use scrap pieces of polymer clay and make simple decorations. I will be covering the majority of my tree in tiny silver balls. Once you have enough, bake for the full duration as per package instructions. For the star on the top of the tree, I painted it silver using mica paint and covered it in glass microbeads. If you don't have any polymer clay, you can also use salt dough or nail decals. For some of the balls I covered them in glitter, the STD of the crafting world. Make sure you're completely covered in protective clothing before you use this stuff as it gets everywhere. I will be picking it off my skin for the next few months. Then you can decorate your tree how you like. If you have pipe cleaners or string, you can use this in place of tinsel. You can also use tiny decals, hearts or stars to decorate your tree as well. Be inventive as there really is no limit. I will also be making a tree skirt as I don't particularly like the stand space. So using some fabric, fold it in half and then half again. And where the folds are, cut a small piece of the corner. This will be the hole for the tree trunk. Then round off the edges in a circular type shape. Then open your circle skirt up and cut a small line from the edge into the center so that you can slip it around your tree more easily. Then I decorated the tree skirt using half fray stop and half mica paint so that the skirt doesn't unravel over time. You can also use ribbon or lace if you prefer. And you're done. 
I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you liked it please give a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments if there are any miniature requests you would like me to do in the future. See you in my next video!